Mm. Hello, Hedgehogs, and welcome to another video. And to be honest with this one, I had absolutely no idea what to do for it. Because I was going to use this video um, as one of those clips while reading that book. But I remembered when I was recording this video how proud I was um, of this particular video because this particular mission in Destiny is one I am absolutely terrified of. It's a just it scared me to hell the first time I did it. Uh, like the first time I played it. So when I was going in this with complete strangers, because I played the first time um, with my fiance, we had uh, the hardest time playing it. So um, when I came into this, uh, um, I was superly like hoping it was gonna pair me up with strangers, because sometimes um, in Destiny, depending on what uh, strike mission you would do. Uh, sometimes it doesn't pay with anyone, so I've gone on like strike missions completely alone, and <laughs> they, they scare me. Like they become intense, intense stress levels. Like I can get through them, but I knew this one I couldn't get through on my own. And so what I thought, because I was super proud of this video and just how um, everyone kind of worked together on this one. Um, I thought it would be just kind of good to do a little bit of a commentary piece of the top of it where I talk about the things that was happening at the time and kind of what I was feeling because when I was playing this I was dead silent and by the end of it when it was finally over I was like breathing a sigh of relief and also um, you haven't missed the beginning of the strike or anything like that. Um, or oh, like much of the beginning of the strike that this is like pretty much the whole entire uh, strike. I do know that um, they do take a little bit longer. Um, I do want to kind of upgrade everything so I can record longer than just 15 minutes at a time. Um, but this, this was a lot of fun. Um, I know when I start playing Destiny and stuff I kind of get into my space of my own so doing commentary while playing is a little bit difficult uh, just because I kind of I, I tend to hyper focus uh, is, is what I would call it and I'm just I'm in the game <laughs> pretty much and I'm just like I gotta kill these things <laughs> I don't think I've had a chance recently uh, to play Destiny uh, which I, I, I want to go back in and um, play some more Destiny because that was a lot of fun. And the video clip when you were watching me kind of do the book and there was gameplay and that was Warframe and I haven't done that for a little bit. Like obviously with the um, Warframe there's a lot more to it and Destiny has updated a lot of stuff so there's a lot more stuff in it that I need to kind of get through and play uh, story wise. Um, I still have a fair few strikes that, that I gotta do, but I kind of decided to lay off for a while just because I was so super stressed um, after completing all these strikes and leveling up and everything. So yeah, I took a little bit of a break from that and uh, went back to uh, playing some Minecraft. So definitely, definitely want to get back into playing Destiny because this is a lot of fun. And I'm super hyped for the new game to come out. Um, I don't know if it's out by the time uh, this video gets uploaded, but yeah, definitely pumped for the for Destiny 2. I remember I had like absolutely no idea about this game in the beginning. It, it was my fiance who was just like, "Hey, there's this day uh, game <coughs> words this game that." Um, I've been playing, it's like really fun, I want you to get it so we can both play together and I was like, oh okay. Um, so I kind of saved up my money, kind of asked for it, hoping I would get it for Christmas and I was lucky enough uh, to get it um, and pay for it for myself um, so that I could play it on uh, PlayStation 4. And 
that was honestly the <laughs> best thing I did. It was a lot of fun. I think I spent so many nights. Um, you know the ones where you don't sleep and you just play video games and then you realize that it's 8 in the morning and you're like, oh, I was supposed to sleep. Whoops. But it was a lot of fun and then, especially around the time when it came out and we started playing it, um, I think in the beginning it didn't have too much, it just kind of had the original story to it. And like, each of those stories were just kind of short little things so you could get through them pretty quick. And then you just kind of head off into the next one. And in the beginning it was so hard, um, because my internet is so horrible, but the servers were just so packed, so I'd constantly be booted from it all the time, it would lag so bad, and I'd have so much trouble just online. But once the new updates came out and the new story mode came out, come out um, the online mode uh, was a lot better, like it, it, it got fixed. It, it was a lot better. And it made things a lot fun. Um, the only problem is when we went back into it in the new update, it didn't remember any of our kind of story mode uh, gameplay that we'd done. And we were like, what the hell? Why, why hasn't it remembered anything? So we kind of had to replay a lot of the older stories again, which um, we weren't too happy about it. We, like, we, we played through it still. Um, but yeah, it was a, a little bit annoying. It's kind of like, well, we've already completed it, why do we have to do it again? But it was because of the uh, new system that they'd done to kind of update it all. I remember um, this bit when we were first playing it and I was literally hiding around the corner trying to snipe um, that uh, witch and oh my god I was terrified like you can see me just hanging around in the back I, I got a little bit more confident I think because um, at the first time I was just Playing, like just going around the corner trying to snipe it <laughs> and, and my fiance was just like what are you doing why are you hiding and I'm like I'm scared I'm terrified it's the sounds I don't know I was so scared I didn't, I didn't want to come out of the corner <laughs> so you can, can definitely say that I've kind of improved since then I actually use bombs now which I didn't kind of use in the beginning of I think there's a lot more stuff that I kind of have started using that I haven't really like hadn't used originally uh, when first playing this or like any game really I'm just like so noobish <laughs> and I kind of realize how noobish like I'm still learning and it probably look like a sucker right <laughs> now um, but I had a lot of fun like it is stressful and um, these these particular particular strikes scare me. I don't know what it is, but it just it gets intense, and I freak out, and I'm like, oh, uh, my muscles are tightening. It's stressful. I think uh, when Destiny 2 comes out, uh, my fiance and I will definitely be playing that, and probably going to be doing the thing where we stay up all through the night, and then it becomes eight in the morning, and I realize that I have stayed up all night again which is fine. Um, I had a lot of fun doing that. This particular part and this particular strike is intense. Let me tell you right now. A anyone who's played this particular mission and you're just like, oh no, nah, it's easy, it's easy. No, it's intense as all hell. Like, oh my gosh. Like the amount of enemies that got swarmed at you. Like this is this is just the beginning, and there are some other like missions and stuff just in in the story alone, or like other strides that are just as intense. But for some reason, this one, this particular one, I think, because it's in such a, a dark kind of area, and there's nowhere for you to really hide as well. Like you've got pillars, but enemies can come around you from like every single angle and I think that just kind of adds um, an extra element uh, to the game so um, as you can tell I am trying to get this over and done with as quickly as possible 
by using my heavy uh, artillery weapon three. But uh, I, I wanted to just have the last witch uh, killed and over and done with because this particular part is just horrible. And I remember just like me and the people that I was playing with just kept dying or it would just be me left. And when it's just me left, I'm just like, oh no, oh no, what do I do? I'm the last person standing, I need to get one of them alive. So I'd be freaking out trying to get one of them alive because I could not do this on my own and knew I would like die if I if I kept running around just on my This is super intense, like you can tell um by the way that I'm like <laughs> Moving the camera around, I'm definitely uh, panicking, and I'm also definitely in my little zone of I need to kill this person or else, basically. Um, so I kept focusing on the witch because once you kill uh, the main boss, like everything else just kind of disappears. So I try not to focus too much on everything else, but like they're just. The enemies that come around you from every single direction. It is just so hard. And like it's 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 super intense. But a lot of fun. It's just stressful, but a lot of fun. I hope the uh, people that I was doing the strike with uh, don't mind too much that they're uh, in the video. Um, but I think I think we work like pretty well um, together considering. Like normally in the strike missions you get some people who come in and what they'll do, especially if I'm playing, playing with my fiance and we get just like one extra person come in for the strike mission as like the third uh, person or whatever, they'll just kind of kind of run around and you'll be like, what are you doing? Why aren't you attacking anyone? And it's because they're kind of using us as experience basically to get through the mission. See, this is where I finally revived someone, and I died, because I was just, I was panicking, I was like, I need to get someone alive, like, I need to get these guys alive, because I cannot be alone, and see, like, did again, it's like, please, please help me, please, but you can see just how intense it got, like, I'm being blasted from every single angle, so this is a part where the other person is now, uh, the only person alive and we're all just like oh god like I can tell everyone is just it's, uh, it's, it's intense definitely intense um, like I said this is one of the strikes that I kind of fear doing the most there's another strike in particular that I fear doing the most um, but I had to rack up a lot of courage to kind of to kind of do this one but um, yeah, I was super proud of the end result. See, we finally, finally beat the witch. And I'm like super happy about the end result. Like, this was amazing. I didn't want to read a story over it just because of how proud I am for completing it. Like, you're all probably just like, what the hell, <laughs> this is horrible. But I had a lot of fun. Um, out of myself so I thought I would do some commentary and I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> uh, I, I'm sure you did, I hope so, I don't know. If you did, so, uh, I want you to whittle over to the like button and sub to subscribe to become a hatchling and I will hopefully see you all in a wingspan. <laughs> hopefully. Please come, <laughs> please come and see some more videos. Bye-bye. <laughs>